Hey, what is up everybody? I'm Starlord and today we're going to be looking at Fallout 4's next DLC, in fact the last DLC, called Nuka World. Now, as many of you probably know by now, Nuka World has been in the works for around about two years now. They was actually working on it back then, two years ago, and you know, it's all built up to this awesome climax that this is going to be the last DLC for this game, and it's going to be pretty awesome. And to be honest guys, judging from the trailer and, you know, the actual description of what this DLC is, it sounds pretty awesome to me. I cannot wait to actually manage a group of raiders. But, besides from that, today we have some new news concerning the DLC itself. So, as you all know, I am a lurker on Steam.db, which is a website that does host a lot of information about different kinds of games or DLC for various games on the Steam website. And yesterday, actually 12 hours ago, there was somebody who checked it and found that it had already been updated with the file size for Nuka World. And that's pretty awesome. I've actually been scanning this website now for the last, like, two weeks. And the day that I don't do it, somebody else does it and finds out before me, and I'm like, wow, geez, guy, thank you. But anyway, all that aside, I can now reveal to you guys that the official size of the Nuka World DLC is 3.66 gigabytes. Yes, that is right, 3.66 gigabytes, which is, you know, that's a pretty big DLC. When we look at Far Harbor, Far Harbor was 2.69, so that's almost near enough a whole gig bigger than, you know, Far Harbor. That's pretty impressive. I am actually pretty impressed by that. And it, all in all, when people were asking me, will it be bigger than Far Harbor? I was like, yeah, it probably will be. You know, they want to go out with a big bang, and that is probably why, you know, they've been working on this for about two years now. Uh, so that is pretty much it, to be honest, guys. We have news that Nuka World is, in fact, 3.66 gigabytes, and I can actually confirm to you guys that when those dates, uh, those numbers actually show on that website, that means that that DLC is officially in a beta stage on that game. So right now, when I check on the actual description uh, here, it says that they have a public beta, which was updated 23 hours ago. They have a beta free updated a day ago, and they also have the 1.7 beta update that is due on consoles this week. And I, this one right here, beta free, that is actually the Nuka World DLC. So there you go guys, they're currently testing, testing it over at Bethesda, and I would say we have to wait another, I'd say about two weeks, until we can get our hands on that DLC. But, Anyway guys, that has pretty much been it for this info video, I hope that you did enjoy it, and if you did, please remember to leave a like, and until next time, I've been Star Lord, I'll see ya! Okay, so here you're seeing my ship inventory, and it's pretty empty, but my exosuit's inventory is pretty full, and this is what we're going to be duplicating.